at the most basic level, the actor model is breaking things into such small modules that all they are doing are sending events to each other and triggering behavior based on those events. And so you could do it with a huge, like you can do it with anything, um, but in state machines, it's your way of breaking your state machines up. So you can choose to invoke an actor. So it's a bit different from if you want to just far off, uh, far and forget action, um, some sort of effect, it's uh, which you can just far off and forget about it. Whereas uh, with an actor, you can actually invoke something that's a lot more long running uh, a process and you could, it will, the state that you invoke it on, it will start in that state. And then when you exit that state, you can stop it. Um, and that's, you can then in actions, you can use actions to send events to and from your actors as well. And so it is more of this decoupling behavior, just trying to break things into the smallest possible pieces that you can um, in order to make it easy f to understand yeah where your data is flowing and uh, how everything's supposed to behave